I kind of think of her like a butterfly. She was trapped in this cocoon. She, and um, with all the support and love that she received from her friends, she was able to transform out of that cocoon and into a butterfly. Barbara Moore was a strong woman who had a vision that the world would be different for others, different more than it was for herself. Barbara had many difficulties in her own life. She had had polio as a child. Uh, she was not trained to work outside the home. Uh, she was in a difficult marriage, and yet she overcame those difficulties. She was a, um, a colorful individual. You know, we laughed a lot. She had a great sense of humor. She was just somebody that saw the best in everybody and was very interested in people. It was typical of Barbara to kind of bring different people together. She loved people. She loved women and children. She was somebody who's non-traditional, unconventional. Barbara was a rebel because social convention was not important to Barbara. And, and she stood on her, on her own ground and defined it her own way. Barbara was one of the earliest advocates for victims of abuse in the home. It was not a cause that was recognized in her time. At a time when women were first beginning to come into the work world, were first stepping out of traditional roles. In a time when being a woman was just not safe, even in the United States. She stood her ground and she was going to make it happen. And as you look around today, it happened. Barbara was able to bring together all the pieces that essentially make up what we have at a domestic violence shelter now. The core pieces are the shelter, the counseling, and the hotline, and created what was then Spouse Abuse Inc. and is now Harbor House of Central Florida. Spouse abuse, it was never spoken about. And Barbara was the one who really brought this to our attention. And her passion then, in a supportive way became our passion. She found a way to make her cause so important in her own life that it became important in the lives of others. And I think more than anything, Barbara Moore was a catalyst for change in this community. Barbara Moore is today a role model for all of us who are still in the movement, who are still fighting for justice and for safety and for every child to grow up in a home where there is no violence. I hope that young people will continue and be passionate about issues and remember that people like Barbara made things happen and so can you.